If you're installing Ubuntu from a USB drive and the installer hangs or freezes at this point, I have a few things that can help you get past that. So first off, you'll need to go and start over and boot from the flash drive, the USB drive, and get to this point. Then you need to hit the E key so that you can edit the grub menu. When you get to this part, you'll go down to this second or third line down that says Linux and you need to edit this line. We need to disable the kernel mode setting functionality of the Nouveau graphics driver by putting Nouveau dot mode set equals zero. I'll add that to the description below. Next, follow the instructions at the bottom of the screen. Tap F10 on the keyboard to continue to boot and now it will go past that part that was stalling because the kernel couldn't handle your graphics card. If this works for you, you'll be able to get to the Ubuntu installer and run through all the install wizard steps, but then your system will reboot and you'll be back in the same problem that you have the first time it boots normally. Now that the installer is loaded, you can install Ubuntu as normal and go through all the steps, and then it will ask you to reboot. Ubuntu is installed, but now when it reboots, it gets stuck again and it hangs at the same spot. We still need to update the graphics drivers. Take out your video card, boot it up all the way. Hopefully you have integrated graphics. Then go in and update your video drivers. Now we need to update the video drivers. Type this command, apt search nvidia-driver-star Pick the best driver for your graphics card and type sudo apt install dash nvidia dash driver dash and then put the number of the driver that you have chosen. Type y to continue and now your graphics driver will update and you will be able to put your graphics card back in and boot it up normally and then be able to do whatever you need to from then on. Reboot your system and then shut it down so you can install your graphics card back in. Then power your system back up and you should have the latest drivers that will have you up and running. Thanks to my friend Scott for helping and thanks you for watching.